Hi everyone, in this video we're going to be going through 2021 AMC 12A problem 17. It tells us that a trapezoid ABCD exists with AB is parallel to CD, with BC equals CD equals 43, and AD is perpendicular to BD. We let O be the intersection of the diagonals, which I'm marking here, and P be the midpoint of BD, and we're given that OP is equal to 11. And in this problem, we're trying to find the length of AD. So I've gone ahead and drawn a diagram and added all of the information that we're given in the problem, and we're going to try and use it to solve. So we start off by letting this angle be A. So if this angle is A, we know that this angle must be 90 minus A because of it is a right triangle and the angles must sum to 180. Because we have parallel lines, this angle must be the same as this angle. So this angle is just equal to 90 minus A. Now we'll see that BDC is an isosceles triangle. And because P is the midpoint, if we draw our altitude, it's actually just going to be a perpendicular bisector by definition. So these are also 90 degree angles. Because they have one, this angle is 90 minus theta, this angle is also, it will be theta to make the sum of the angles 180. If we look at our triangle BPC, this angle will also be 90 minus theta because our triangles are, this triangle is isosceles. And similarly, this will be equal to A. So now we have a lot of these angles marked down. And it comes easy to notice that there we have some nice similar triangles. We have that DPC is going to be similar to BDA. We also have that triangle OPC is similar to triangle ODA. So these similar triangles can help us calculate the length of AD. From here, we realize that the, the length of DP is exactly half of DB because we have two of the same length, DP is equal to PB, so we have two of the same length in DB. So because DP is equal to one half of DB, we know that the ratio between our similar triangles DPC and BDA is one to two. So in triangle DPC, our hypotenuse is 43, and in triangle BDA, it's gonna be double that, so 86. And that also tells us that our triangles OPC and ODA, these also have a ratio of one to two. So if this length here is 11, our length OP, OD is going to be double that, which is 11 times 2, or 22. That tells us that our entire length for DB is 22 plus 11 times 2, which is 66. This whole thing is going to be 66. Now all we have to do is apply Pythagorean theorem to find AD. So we have a square root of 86 squared minus 66 squared, and this is going to come out to be 4 square root 190. And we're trying to find the sum of m plus n, where our answer is in the form of m root n. So our answer is just 4 plus 190, which is 194. And that's option choice D, which is our answer. Thanks for watching.